this looks like it's been hit by an aircraft look it's just up there so it looks to be something over there as well in the bushes hello explorers i'm in somewhere in the south i'm not actually trying to hide the location i don't actually know where i am i set off from macclesfield and i'm driving to telford and i'm in the middle of there i've passed the m6 so i'll try and I'll find out where I am and I'll put, I'll, I'll put it in the description but I'm just on the side of the road and yeah I'm on the G7X Mark II at the minute so the view's a bit different than normal so I'm not on the 90D so uh, just driving along and there was this canal went around this corner and up on that hill there's a pillbox so just thought I'd pull up and film it one pillbox. Looks a bit battered as well. So what's going on here then? Because it's all mounded up. Weird. Because this isn't natural, this. I want to get round the back a bit and climb up. Rather than just climb up, because I don't want to give my position away to everybody. See, this is all man-made, it's very strange, this. And then to put a pillbox on top is even more strange. There looks to be something over there as well, in the bushes. Well, let's go look at this first. It's been well graffitied. Sadly, it's viewable from the viewable from the road so so it's been targeted but this looks like it's been hit by an aircraft look there's like as if someone strafed it yeah, it has it's been hit there's like bullet hole there bullet hole there and it's blown the roof off yeah, it's like 20 millimeter there there so this has actually seen some action. It's this part that's blown off as well. This has definitely seen some action. Let's turn the light on. Let's get in there. It's quite low. different layout to what I'm used to. If anybody out there knows what um, type of pillbox this is, please leave a comment below. You can see there where the, the roof's been blown off. Nature's taking it back. It's got these like cutouts here. I don't know what these are for. These cutouts. The ivy looks quite cool the way it's coming in. There's one pillbox at the side of the road. It's one of my random little finds. It's amazing when you're just driving around, you see stuff and you think, oh, what's that? I'll go have a look at that. Well, here we are, one pillbox. We're going to have a look over there in a minute. I'm just going to get some still shots of in here. Um, but my hair sticking out of the bottom of the eye, it really annoys me. Yeah, we'll get some still shots of in here. And then we'll go over there, see if there's anything else dotted about. Put me there for a minute. Sort the hat out. 
I need a haircut, but Boris has shut them again. Yes, this has definitely seen some action. It's a roof missing. I've never seen one of these pillboxes that's actually been hit by anything and like strafed as such. It's right, time for some stills. Check out my Instagram and Twitter for daily updates. Right, back outside. We're just I've just been taking some still shots for Twitter and Instagram and the community page and all that jazz. And I'm just gonna check out the rest of this mound because it looks man-made. As if this has had maybe anti-aircraft guns on it or something. See how it, like, unnatural it is. The lay of the land is quite flat. And then here, is all it like, mounded up. So let's just check this out. Yeah, there's like a, a concrete block or something there. Yeah, there's something there. That is... That is a mount for a spigot mortar. That mount there, because it's got the central pivot in it. So that's a spigot mortar. We're probably going to find some more things here. Uh, I'll put a picture of what a spigot mortar is now. It was a, 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 a like a ground defence anti-vehicle like rocket mortar thing, it was spring loaded um, to attack invasion attack in yeah, attack invaders so it would have had a clear view of all this road up here and that pillbox will have done as well so that's why they built it here see what else is up on here See, this to me, the sort of circle layout of this, this says to me anti-aircraft gun. The way it's mounded up and the way it's got a clear view all the way around. And this is on the way to Stoke-on-Trent and Telford, places like that. So, let's just keep checking. I don't want to point you that way because you're into the sun then, but loads of glare. See that there? That's a central point for an anti-aircraft gun. That's what that is. So they had a gun on here. Had a flat gun on this position. Right there. Just found it in the moss. That's like a concrete base they used to mount the centre point to. Cool little find just on the side of the road. Get out of here. Just got to get down here without falling now. It's quite steep and it's very wet. So, just getting down. I'm going to show you the front of this pillbox and anti aircraft position. See how it's all built up up there? Anti aircraft gun mound. And the pillbox is up there. And it's got a spigot mortar there. So, between them, they had quite a little. Uh, quite a little defensive position here quite well uh, armed just for the side of a road so they've got uh, like anti-vehicle anti-personnel and anti-aircraft gun all here just at the side of the road quite cool 
it's just getting slowly taken back by nature now so if you're liking this sort of content please leave a comment uh, and if you haven't done so already please consider subscribing to the channel and hit the bell for notifications of more videos bring videos out on a Tuesday and a Thursday at 8 p.m. and live streams are a bit more random but I'll put updates on my social media and community page on YouTube and I forgot to mention thank you so much everybody who's watched this video it means a lot to me it really does so bye bye for now looking over my shoulder looking back at your door in my head it goes over and over should I leave or want it more looking